Hi, today we are going to code the guessing game. The guessing game is probably the simplest Python program you can write. It's often the first program I introduce when I'm teaching Python to new developers. It's a fun game and it's really useful to learn the basics of Python with this game. In the guessing game, the computer will think of a number and we have to guess the number. So we can guess a number, let's say we guess 75 and then the computer will tell us whether our number is higher or lower. So in this case, it tells us 75 is too high and we should guess a smaller number. Okay, let's guess 50. Okay, 50 is also too high. 25 is also too high. Okay, 10 is too low. So we know the number is between 10 and 25. So it's lower than 12. And so there it is, the number is 11. Okay, so let us code this program. The first thing is, the computer has to think of a number. The computer will choose a number between 0 and 99. Next, we have to get the guess from the user. Okay, so Now, if this guess is higher than the actual number, we'll print, we'll ask the user to guess a lower number. Else, if the guess is lesser than the actual number, we'll ask the user to guess a higher number. And we will take this input, we'll convert it to an integer. All right, now we need to keep doing this until the user gets the number right. So while the guess is not equal to the number, we'll keep doing this. And initially we'll set guess to none. And finally, once they get it correct, we'll print out the success message. Okay, this time I'm going to think of 50. No, it's lower, lower, higher, lower and this time the number was 13 and we've got it so this is the basic version of the guessing game in the basic version the computer thinks of a number and we have to guess the number now we can also turn this game around and in the second version we will think of a number and the computer has to guess it Let's say that we think of a number 50, the computer will guess a number, let's say 25, and we will input whether the guess was too low or too high, and accordingly the computer has to guess another number until the computer guesses it correctly. So how do we code this reverse version of the guessing game? Let's think about that. One way we could do it is, we could have the computer just keep guessing random numbers. So let's try that out. It's 
So we will input C if the guess that the computer did is correct or not. Computer will just make a guess and then we'll print that out. And then we'll ask the user, is it correct or is it too high or is it too low? So let's first think of a number. Let's say that our number is 55. Okay. So first the computer guesses 73. That's too high. Then 53. That's too low. And then 31. That's too low. 82. That's too high. So you can see here the computer is just randomly guessing numbers. Now the problem is although we are saying the number is too high or the number is too low, the computer is really not taking that into account. So for example, even though I said that the number 53 is too low, but still the computer is guessing 49 later on, right? Even though 53 is too low, obviously the number cannot be 49. So how can we improve this? How do we make the computer use that information? Now when the use a computer guesses 73 and we specify that it's too high, um, then we know that now the number has to be only between 0 and 73. So the next time we don't need to guess a number between 0 and 99. We can just guess a number between 0 and 73. And then same way when we specify that 53 is too low. So next time we don't need to guess a number between 0 and 73. We can guess a number between 53 and 73 because we know that the number has to be between those two. Okay, so let us use that information. We'll say max number is 99 and the minimum number is 0 at the start of the program. So we'll guess a random number between the minimum number and the maximum number. Now if the guess is that it is too high, the max number is 73. It cannot be more than 73. So the max number will be number and 73 is wrong, right? We specified it's too high. So actually the maximum can be 72. Okay, so when we set the max number like this, then the next time the computer will not guess a number between 0 and 99. It will guess a number between 0 and 72. Okay, what if we inputted that the number was too low? So when it's too low, the minimum number will change. So for example, the computer guessed 53. So it means the number can be only from 54 onwards. It cannot be any number less than 53. So minimum number will be number plus one. All right. Okay, so as before, our number is 55. The computer has guessed 49, that's too low. And it's guessed 58, that's too high. So you can see now because we specified 49 is too low and 58 is too high. So the next guess, it has guessed a number in between those two. In this case, it's 54, that's too low. 56, that's also too high. And finally, it has got our number 55, which is correct. And with that, the program is complete. That's the other type of guessing game in which we think of a number and the computer tries to guess it.